Hello, my beautiful sweets. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day, afternoon, evening, whatever time you're watching this video. You guys, hoo hoo hoo. Lord, that booster shot. Mm hmm. Yeah. It laid me out yesterday, but it was all good because I was able to just rest. I mean, I didn't have any appetite or anything, but I wasn't able to film this yesterday because. I got the booster and the flu shot on Monday, so just in case anything happened, I was prepared um, so that I would just rest all day long, and that's what I did. I feel still a little weak today, not like back to my normal self, but I feel so much better, thank God. But I wanted to share this little Valentine's haul with you guys. I showed you when I was doing the walkthrough, but I never got to actually haul it. So I'm going to show you the few, the few little things that I picked up so far. And I might pick up a few more here or there, but not a whole lot because I'm telling y'all, the Dollar Tree is getting on my nerves. They're downsizing everything and charging you the same dollar right now, but eventually they're going to be charging you $1.25 for it. And I was in Walmart, I was in Food Line, I was in all the other stores and you can get big, giant um, thick packs of Vanity Fair napkins for $2. Okay. And they had so much more in them. Look at this. Look how they have downsized this pack of napkins. They used to be bigger and you used to get more. I'm not really sure they're saying you get 50 in here. I know for a fact you used to get more and they were larger. And I was just in full line and saw the Vanity Fair ones for only $2 y'all. It would be worth your money to me. So just go ahead to Food Line, Walmart, wherever. Y'all know, Aldi's. Aldi's always have good prices. So, anywho, I digress. <laughs> Sorry about that. I am going off on a tangent because Dollar Tree is getting on my nerves. My favorite, favorite place in the world is getting on my nerves, y'all. How could this be? <laughs> anywho, when I was in Wake Forest, most of this stuff came from Wake Forest. Yes, most of this stuff. But I found the little gumball machines, and I keep forgetting to find, um, look for the little um, gumballs or jelly beans or something that's small enough to fit into these little holes that they have. As you can see, this just screws off. And there's your little holes in there. You get three holes. And there's the little turn right there. They are so cute. And they were going so fast in that store, y'all. I didn't see any in my large Dollar Tree today. Not yet. They are just now starting to put all their stuff out. So, But I went ahead and grabbed me one of each so I could use them as part of my decoration. So my sisters were telling me at Christmas how much they love these pens. Well, one of them was because my other one and my mother love these pens. Y'all heard me say so many times before, my mother loves these pens. These are nice, big, fat pens. And everybody that I send one, they love them. So, of course, my sister, Tardy to the Party, the youngest one, was trying to tell me how much she loved these pens. <laughs> So while I was at Wake Forest store, they had plenty of them. I just picked up one of each for them. Maybe. We'll see how many I give them. I don't know. I picked up, intentionally, I picked up one of each color for them. But I may keep some for myself because I love these pens as well. So there you have it. These are ballpoint pens. They write so well. They last a long time. They're well worth a dollar. <sighs> I know, I'm growling at that. <laughs> they are well worth a dollar and maybe even a dollar twenty-five. I wouldn't mind paying a dollar twenty-five for those pens because I like them that much. Unless they shrink them or they don't last as long or something like that. Yeah, then I may I will have a problem with it. Okay, moving right along. I know I'm a little salty today, sorry. <laughs> I was looking for these little um what do you call it? Just decor. And I've seen them on other people's channels, but I can't think of who. And they had like three or four different ones. I was looking for the one, I think, that said baking. I'm not really sure. But this was in a random place. Looked like somebody had just changed their mind and said, I'm not getting that, so I'm going to lay it right here. And I snagged it up. And I was really happy to get it because at least it has kitchen. You know, kitchens were made for families to gather. And I really, really like that. That's so cute. I will probably be hanging that somewhere over here. You know, just looks so cute, like a little cutting board or 
What is those things we, we got with the hands? Y'all know I can't think. Anyway, moving right along, I found these two signs. They had so many Valentine decorations, just like they did for Christmas. They are just cranking it out, crack a lacking it out. And yeah, you can lose your mind if you don't reel it back in. But I did see a few pieces that I really, really wanted. And these were two of them. The red one that says love with the Nomi. <laughs> and the pink one that says XOXO. And I got this one with the truck with the Nomi's on the back. Oh, that is so darling. I really, really had to pick through them, y'all, because I didn't know which one I wanted. They had one like this with just the hands around the heart that said love, but this was the one I chose. And y'all know you can decorate on the back of them because they're blank, so you can use this for two for, two for something, you know? All of these you could do that way. You could turn them over and do something on the back. And of course, y'all know I was trying to be strong. I really was, y'all. I walked away from them. And went around a couple of aisles and came back and said, I just cannot. I cannot leave my Nomi's here. <laughs> they are so darling. You got the red one with the, blue, with the pink hat and the heart. You got the blue one with the red heart and the silver heart. Just so cute. And then you got the silver one with the pink hat. I'm like, oh my God. For the... For the gnomes to come to my stores, any of my stores, and I actually catch them, that is huge for me. Because I went to my Lord's Dollar Tree today, and they had all the fuzzy friends. They had them all, except for the gnomes. But they also had a huge, huge U-boat of Valentine's stuff to put out. So maybe. You know, they had the um, Christmas one, so I'm holding out. I'm holding out. And when I saw these, y'all, oh, my Lord, these are so cute. I have a girlfriend that loves her beetles. <laughs> my girl, Sharbar, she has one of these. When we were kids and we were traveling, my mother and father were taking us up and down the road, down south. Every time we had this game that we played, and I don't even know what it was all about, but every time we saw a beetle, the first one that would yell out, uh, punch car, you would actually win. Now, you, we didn't win nothing. You just... You just got it first. But that's what we always call these little beetles. I saw this one, y'all. I was just like, oh my God, I've got to have that. This one just says, heartbreaker, love, XOXO. Isn't that darling? Oh my God, had to have her. And then this one wasn't as thrilling, but I still liked her. And this one was the red truck with the love and all the hearts and be mine. That's so cute. So uh, I had to get them both because they were unusual, they were lightweight, and I think I could just, you know, do something with those. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay, staying in the Valentine's, I found a infinity scarf. It doesn't say infinity on it. It just says scarf, but it is an infinity scarf. It is gnome. Gnome is where the heart is. <laughs> it's got the male, the male gnome and the female gnome. <laughs> Had to get it. So beautiful. I found the socks too. Well, they had a lot more socks out there, y'all. But these were the two that I chose. Of course, the red and pink truck. And they're in 6 to 12 sizes. Crew socks. And then I got the Nomi ones. So I had to get these. Just had to. Had to have them. So I think that's it for the Valentine stuff for right now. But I did pick up a few miscellaneous things. I found these JR Dippers cheese dip and breadsticks now i didn't need those these are not something i eat all the time but they're nice little snacks and i was like uh if i don't eat them i'll just pass them on to my um church my mother's church for first lady to you know divvy out to the um people in need these are the cheese ones are 70 calories per serving and the pretzel ones cheese dip with the pretzel ones they're 60 calories per serving so I just thought they've had these before. I've seen them before, but they restocked, so I grabbed some. Then I saw these cute, fashionably me, sticker by number, right up in the front by the register. And this was so cute. All I saw was the bubble gum, really. <laughs> and it says, create your own work of art. And I grabbed it. I just said, oh, this is going to be so cute. It's got all these stickers in it. It's got the stickers here. And then you see here where it says the numbers, 
those are the stickers that you put on the numbers and there's the picture <laughs> so i thought that was pretty cute i might send that to zz my niece we'll see if i don't play with it myself y'all know Mm -hmm. I ain't got no shame. I'm a big old kid. <laughs> and I did give me a pack of my spearmint gum, but I already opened this because, yeah, got to have gum on you at all times. Need it, want it, got it. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Love, peace, and happiness. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Remember, guys, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. I love you guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Bye.